Kirby Shambler's temporarily changed propellers to do some quick pre-race testing with a new MT design, but will be sticking to his regular Hartzell in London. It's designed for the racing. It's probably six pounds lighter. Uh, the construction on it is fantastic. I mean, it's a beautiful propeller. So we'll just see how it all shakes out. British pilot Nigel Lamb has made some big changes to the setup of his aileron controls for more stability and is hoping his new longer wingtips will provide some benefit. It gives me more speed out of the turn and I, and I have slightly less agility because the roll rate is lower. So agility is down but it's a straightish course. Having said that, there's a lot of twisting and turning, albeit for small angles, but you have to do it very quickly because the gates are very, very bunched up. South African Glenn Dell has made some new modifications and managed to squeeze a few seconds out of his plane by borrowing a propeller from a very kind competitor. It's the best propeller for racing. So, uh, together with the other modifications that we have here, we think that uh, the, with the propeller and the wingtips and the modifications that we've done to the uh, wheels fairing, it should uh, save us 10 seconds in the race. Championship leader Paul Bonham saw no risk lending the rookie a spare that was identical to the one Dell has on order. 